Hi, I'm Josh, and I'm going to tell you a little bit about a platypus. There is the most evolutionary distinct mammal on the planet. Um, obviously the most identifying feature is this beautiful bill here, which is actually nothing like a duck bill at all. It's, it's, it's quite soft and pliable. and has that amazing ability to detect its prey underwater using electroreception. And then sitting behind the bill you have the eye and ear which sit in a little groove and when they dive a muscle actually closes the whole system so they don't actually use their eyes underwater at all. They're quite unusual in that they swim with their front feet whereas most aquatic animals will swim with their hind feet. So very extensively webbed front feet, so very strong swimmers. They can then sort of pull that in for the return stroke to reduce drag and make their swimming more efficient. And then of course, because they live on, you know, they can travel on land as well, the whole, all the webbing actually folds underneath and their claws get exposed so they can dig their burrow. So it's a really neat little system that they've got. Whereas their back feet aren't involved in swimming at all, so very little webbing. Um, they tend to just sit by the, the side of the body and use a little bit for, um, for steering, that's about it. Um, I've got a very, dense waterproof fur, traps a layer of air next to the body when they dive which insulates the body and maintains their body temperature and they can store up to a third of their body fat in their tail. So obviously when conditions are good they build up condition and store all that fat so they can then draw on it when, uh, when there's not so much food around. And that gives me an idea of the condition of the animal by the size and shape of its, of its tail. Yeah so our most distant mammalian relative and possibly the most unusual creature on the planet.